Candy cane tetras are freshwater tropical fish that are usually commercially tank bred. They have a pretty rosy salmon-colored body, which gives them a striking appearance in an aquascaped or planted tank. Here are some tips for taking care of candy cane tetras. Tank size, candy cane tetra are shoaling fish and need to be kept in groups of at least six. A 15 gallon tank is recommended. Water parameters, candy cane tetras prefer a temperature range of 72 Fahrenheit to 82 Fahrenheit and a pH range of 6.0 to 7.5. Tank setup and decorations. Candy cane tetra are peaceful fish that prefer a well-planted aquarium with plenty of hiding places. Soft lighting and hiding spots are ideal for these peaceful fish. Keep the water slow and passive. Filtration and aeration. Regular water changes and filtration are necessary to maintain good water quality. Diet. Candy cane tetra are omnivores and their diet should consist of flakes, pellets, live food, and frozen food. To keep your candy cane tetra healthy, providing them with a varied diet is important. They should be fed two to three times a day. Candy cane tetras are peaceful fish and make excellent fish in a community tank setup. Some great tank mates for your candy cane tetra are other tetras, rasboras, barbs, and corridoras. It is important to choose fish with the same temperament and provide them with enough space. Breeding candy cane tetra is a bit tricky, but it can be done. Here are some tips to help you get started. Separate breeding tank. Isolate the breeding pair in a separate tank with floating or other fine leaf plants where the female will distribute her eggs. Seeded sponge filter. Provide a seeded sponge filter to provide aeration and water circulation. Water parameters. Maintain the water temperature between 75 to 82 Fahrenheit and pH between 6.0 and 7.5. Hatching. Once laid, the eggs will hatch in about 24 to 36 hours to produce fry that can be fed small amounts of infusoria or liquid fry food. 